Hi guys. It is a spectacularly gorgeous, and I do mean over-the-top beautiful spring day. Here in the end times, it's somewhere around Wednesday. It's somewhere around April 28th, 2021, somewhere in that general vicinity, and I am cruising across the lovely state of Virginia, coming into Charlottesville, Virginia, for a couple of days to see some folks. Uh, that noise you're hearing is my kayak vibrating, by the way. So anyway, guys, I just want to throw this out there. This is a message for any tribes member who is a musician, who is a singer, hopefully a guitar or piano player or whatnot. I am, uh, I have a job for our fellow Doomer musicians. Uh, I am not a singer and I don't play guitar, so uh, I'm a little bit stuck. And, and this particular rant is directed at Simon and Garfunkel fans. If we have any Simon and Garfunkel fans, although it's going to be more general. So, uh, you know, for probably going on two years, I have been wondering, you know, where the hell to take Humpty Dumpty Tribe and what to do with his channel and this Hambone Little Tail character. So, you know, I, is it my 12th birthday? I think it's, it's, I'm losing track. Does Humpty Dumpty Tribe turn 12? Uh, here in a couple of weeks, I think about two weeks from today. But anyway, uh, what I've wanted to do uh, for years is uh, become a Doomer parody songwriter. And that's looking at, uh, you know, old songs and making Doomer parodies of them. Now, of course, since I am a 61-year-old fart and I stopped listening to popular music back in uh, probably about 1975, uh, any popular hits that, uh, that I know the tunes and the words to are probably predate about 1975, so I'm probably talking to my fellow old fart doomers. So I'm talking uh, Bob Dylan, Neil Young, The Grateful Dead, Credence Clearwater, uh, those guys, and also not just the, the rock and roll years, but also when country was still cool. You know, Johnny Cash and Merle Haggard and uh, folks like that. So uh, I want to start writing uh, parodies, kind of become the weird Al Yankovic of uh, the Doomosphere. It's kind of where I want to put myself, but since I do not sing or play guitar, you know, I can I can write the lyrics to the songs, uh, but I'm going to have to find other people in the tribe. And, and you know, I want several people to join in on this. So what I am, uh, what I have been doing the past week is uh, writing parodies of Simon and Garfunkel's greatest hits. Uh, so these are from right around 1970. I would say, yeah, pretty much call it 1970. Uh, there's, I think there's 12 songs on that uh, album, Simon and Garfunkel's Greatest Hits. So I have done seven of them. I have done seven of them. All right, let me see if I can just wing this. Uh, these Doomer parodies. Well, one of them uh, is not necessarily a Doomer parody. It's just a parody of the song Homeward Bound. Uh, I have rewritten Homeward Bound to Trailer Bound about life living in a run-down, beat-up old trailer. 
Uh, so if anybody uh, wants to take on the challenge of, uh, of that, that one is open. Okay, I have done five Doomer songs. Okay, what are the Doomer songs? Okay, one is, you know, the song The Boxer. Uh, I have done, redone The Boxer as The Shopper. Now, I think that, um, that Sister Ariel in Atlanta, I think that Ariel is going to cover The Shopper and... I, uh, I wanted Ariel to cover Americans, you know that song, America, Let Us Be Lovers, We'll Marry Our Fortunes, all, all that one. I wanted, uh, and I still want Ariel to cover that, but she emailed me today and uh, said very modestly that uh, she did not have the vocal range for America and she would rather take the Eve of Mad Max which is the sounds of silence uh, right now the sounds of silence the Eve of Mad Max and Americans uh, which is their song America one of those is open and Ariel's going to take the other. Uh, and I'm heading into Charlottesville and meeting up with Osama number five. And Osama might take one or two or he might have a friend who's willing to join us on this. But right now, what is available, and i just throwing it out there, all right, uh, Americans, which is America. Okay, you know that song, uh, Feeling Groovy. It's uh, technically the 59th Bridge Street song, but you know that song, Feeling Groovy. Uh, I have rewritten that as Feeling Doomy. So that's a catchy little song. Uh, so Feeling Doomy is open. All right, you probably know that song, El Condor Pasa. Uh, I'd rather be a hammer than a nail, all that, that old Peruvian folk song. Uh, I have rewritten El Condor Pasa as La Planeta Murere, which means the planet dies. So we have uh, El Condor Pasa, if you uh, know that old Peruvian folk song maybe you play the flute that one is open uh, I am a doomer you know that song I am a rock I am an island uh, that one is available it is I am a doomer uh, I wish I had these written out I'm losing track how many have I how many have I gone through Okay, Trailer Bound, Americans, The Shopper, I Am a Doomer, La Planeta Mutter. Okay, there's two more. Now the next one, uh, the final hardcore Doomer run, it, it might be the most twisted of all. It is the most personal, uh, you know, Kathy's song. I hear the drizzle of the rain in that one. I have rewritten Kathy's song as Hambone's song, and uh, that one is pretty fucking sick and twisted. Uh, I'm not sure anybody really wants to sing Hambone's song. Uh, I might be forced to sing it myself, but it really needs to be a guy singing that one. So if there's any guy who wants to sing Hambone's song uh, in place of Kathy's song. So that's number six. And then the very last one is, uh, I mean, it's open to anyone, but it was written for the anti-masker out there. 
to the tune of Bridge Over Troubled Water, which is a very, uh, you know, Bridge Over Troubled Water is not a song for pussies. Uh, good God, we really need the vocal range. And this is particularly open to anti-maskers, mask over panicked sheeple instead of bridge over troubled water we have masked mask over panicked sheeple is available to anyone who uh, any anti-masker out there so uh, let me know if you're in, interested in any of them just send me an email to Humpty Dumpty Tribe at gmail.com. Oh yeah, and I'm also I'm probably moving into Bob Dylan. And I also have We Shall Be Policed to the tune of I Shall Be Released. Now I actually wrote and you can find it on her. I actually wrote We Shall Be Policed. Uh, when was it? Four or five years ago, but I want to update We Shall Be Policed, so uh, that's a pretty easy one. And uh, so I'm probably going to move into uh, some more Bob Dylan tunes coming up shortly. And I'm, I'm here for recommendations. Bob Dylan tunes, uh, <laughs> Uh, you know, through those late 60s, early 70s, if you can think of any songs you would like me to parody into Doomer songs, uh, send me your suggestions. I am all ears open to suggestions. Uh, but I want to make this a regular feature, so I really want to start, uh, you know, getting a stable of... Uh, <clears throat> guitar picking doomer singers in the tribe who want to be part of this prod this is going to be an ongoing project uh maybe once a week during the summer we will be writing a new doomer a new doomer tune so uh let me know humpty dumpty tribe at gmail.com and we will uh figure out what we can do together and I have got to pay attention to my goddamn driving right now. And I suggest you pay attention to your driving while you still can. And I hope to hear from you, fellow Doomer pickers and grinners. Bye, guys.